This project is about interviewing women of influence and getting advice from them on how they became successful and got to the position that they are in now. You hear the word no all the time and you hear that you're going to hear the word no all the time and this is exactly what happened to these women, but it's important to not let that stop you. I'll never forget when uh, Julia Kayam said yes and it was like we had just received a million dollars. I think everyone just sort of was excited. And then moving on from there, we had uh, just this incredible positive reception of uh, interest from women who I had only, quite frankly, seen on television. Martha Coakley just, she's done so much and I want to be an attorney, so it was kind of like someone to look up to. And then with Joyce Linehan, the fact that she went from being someone involved with music to a politician, it's kind of like there is no clear path. You can literally do whatever you want and then end up doing whatever you want. Most people learn through being able to put uh, something into a, a context, into a reality. The fact that they were able to sit down with an individual who made it in a career that they might have imagined one day and truly be able to visualize themselves in that situation was priceless. Every woman that we interviewed and started from nothing had to work their butts off to get to where they are. Being involved with Artists for Humanity and this project, I feel like I haven't had any personal obstacles or professional obstacles that I feel I couldn't overcome. For girls who come from a background like mine, it's important for them to realize that they can do it despite people, millions of people, like telling them they're not supposed to do it, they can't do it. They all have done so many different things in their lives to get to where they have and where they started is like nowhere near where they are now. So I kind of, I'm, I'm kind of like having fun going on that journey and you know, getting my hands dirty. So I guess that'd be like my favorite piece of advice is just don't be afraid to get your hands dirty.